One of the things that makes Boston College unique is that there is a very strong focus on imbuing the students with a set of values, a set of characteristics they'll carry with them uh, into their professional lives, and thinking very carefully about what are those values? What do we want people to take when they leave the building? To think about, you know, that, again, that notion of what can I give back to the community? How can I make a difference? How can I use my skills to improve people's lives? And to me, that's the central mission, the central value system that BC Law has always stood for and that I imagine will stand for going forward. Before I got to law school, uh, I was a public school teacher. I taught middle school for about seven years, and then I taught four years of high school as a school teacher, I was an advocate for children and for youth, and I figured it was time for me to take my advocacy into another realm. I've long desired being an attorney, and so I figured if not now, then when? Boston College was my inevitable choice ever since I stepped foot on this campus. The people were so genuinely kind and open and very friendly, and I felt a connection to this place. There was a, a, a spirit that I had never felt nor expected at a law school. And I knew right away this was the place for me. I've learned that where I think I fit in the legal world is ultimately helping to frame some of our nation's laws. 10, 15 years, perhaps in Congress and some representational capacity. And Boston College has helped me come to that decision because it has uh, it's given me the sense of purpose, the sense of great moral duty, that's what you get from, from this school. I have a career before law school in international relations. I spent about 10 years working on development work and post-conflict peace building. I started thinking about going to law school when I um, was working in Macedonia and realizing that the work I did wasn't really having the effect that I'd hoped. I started thinking about taking a career where I could actually help people one at a time. Our charity started as an independent study at Boston College Law School. We provide high school education, scholarships, and social support to girls in a small village of former Yugoslavia, Morani, Macedonia. Our purpose is to help girls get through all four years of high school. Already you can see that attitudes about sending girls to high school have changed, and the families that we've served are enormously grateful and supportive of our work. I felt from the day that I started school that anything I wanted to do that was going to have a social justice impact was going to be supported by Boston College Law School. One of the hallmarks of Boston College always has been that it's not just the elite that attend school here. Boston College has always opened the door when other schools weren't opening the doors to those various ethnic groups. And that's something that financial aid and donations enables us to continue and to grow upon. Supporting Boston College Law School in any way you can is very important. BC Law School teaches you to be a very fine lawyer. But it teaches you something more than that. It teaches you a love of the law, and it teaches you a respect for it, and a respect for what it can do. And we need an institution that imbues its students with a sense of purpose. There's such a need, I think, for social justice. There's a need for people who are willing to give back to the community. There's a need for attorneys of principle. We become, in that regard, the sentinel of justice. <laughs>